in our newspaper naked. You can go get the newspaper <laughs> naked if it's zero visibility. Nobody will see it. All right, time to check out some travel treasures with our buddy Gabe Saglier. Hey, Gabe. I've done that, by the way. I've, I've shot out. I'm in my boxers in the morning. I'm thinking nobody's going to be out at this time. If I go run out and get the paper, no one's going to see. And, of course, you've got, you know, all the kids going to school in the morning. And then Oops. It's a, it's a, it's a not a good scene. we got to wait until visibility uh, is zero. Mm. Now you know. Yeah. All right. Well, no, the visibility is a beautiful, crisp, clear morning, unfortunately. So <laughs> uh, I learned the hard way. All right. Let's, um, let's talk about some great getaways. You know, we, uh, we love Hawaii. Uh, and as we get into the uh, summer, into the winter season, we start to reminisce about those great beachy days that we could be enjoying on in the uh, shores of Hawaii. Here, uh, here's a trick with Hawaii. December 20th is when prices will begin to climb in earnest out there in Hawaii. So between now and mid-December, great time to go. Uh, the Waikiki Beach Marriott Resort and Spa on the beautiful island of Oahu, beautiful four-star resort. Uh, right there on uh, Waikiki Beach near the Waikiki Aquarium and the Honolulu Zoo. But who cares? It's they're right there on the beach. Uh, the rate for one of their upgraded partial ocean view rooms, $2.29 a night. Uh, and that's for travel through mid December. And then right after the peak uh, winter days, like in uh, February, March, you can, you can uh, cash in on that rate as well. So Hawaii is possible. Uh, all you got to do is just play with your dates uh, and uh, get out there and enjoy. I'm going to be going to Hawaii. What day is this? In a couple of weeks, because this is really the best time to go. The crowds are thin, the prices are low, and I'll see you out there, okay? Uh, how about some drivable getaways? If you want to save some money, just kind of keep it close to home. Here are some, some great options for you. In beautiful Sonoma, the harvest, uh, the grape harvest this year is already sort of coming to an end, uh, but still, this is a great time to go. The crowds have uh, dissipated, uh, and you see some great rates. This is the Boone Hotel in Guerneville, there in Sonoma County. Very sleek, eco friendly hotel near the Russian River and the beautiful Armstrong Redwood State Na uh, Natural Reserve. Um, 369 gets you a two night stay over a weekend. So a two-night weekend getaway for 369 here. You get breakfast uh, every morning. You get wine tasting in the area. Uh, great little upscale, sleek, eco-friendly escape to Sonoma County. Uh, in Pacific Grove, there's a great property called the Martine Inn. Also a two-night stay here. The price point is, two, is 329. You get breakfast daily. You get bubbly and chocolate-covered strawberries delivered to your room as well. That's part of the part of the experience here at the Martine Inn. Uh, great little B&B &B breakfast located waterfront there in Pacific Grove. Uh, and again, two nights, 329 for travel over the next several months. You also get a, a, a massage credit for, for, with, this, uh, with this deal as well because after you've been wine tasting all day, there's nothing like a great massage to help uh, usher in the evening. How about Fort Bragg? Uh, this is a great oceanfront location uh, where, you know, Mother Nature is at, it, at, at her rawest and at her best there where the cliffs meet the ocean. Beautiful Fort Bragg. This is the Servant Sand Lodge, quaint beachside property, just 50 yards from the beach there in Mendocino County. A two-night stay here in an ocean view room will run you $1.99. And you get breakfast uh, daily, and you get a $100 couple's massage. See, this is neat, because then you're not just saying goodbye to your sweetheart, because you're going to get... Then the two of you can do the massage together there at the Surf and Sand Lodge in Fort Bragg. Uh, and South Lake Tahoe, the neat thing about this deal at the Beach Retreat and Lodge in South Lake Tahoe is that it actually encompasses some early ski season dates. Uh, so you can actually do some skiing, or you can just uh, hang out at the lodge and uh, do, the, you know, do what I do. I just drink the toddy by the fireplace, watch everybody else do the skiing. Uh, beach Retreat and Lodge, uh, beautiful little waterfront property here. You can do a uh, two-night stay here for $159, uh, and you get a couple of welcome cocktails as well when you show up for travel all the way through January. The fact of the matter is the, th the first three to four weeks of ski season anywhere, whether it's Tahoe, whether it's Vail, those first three to four weeks offer the best savings. The snow is not as good as it's going to be uh, later on in the season, but um, great time to uh, save some money. Before I say goodbye for now, I want to mm -hmm. say, Last night I was, uh, was emceeing an event uh, down here in Santa Barbara. I met Victor Robles, 13 years old. He and his mom, Brenda, moved uh, from Sacramento to Santa Barbara about a year ago, but he was so starstruck when he saw me <laughs> because he used to see me on the show. Because when they lived in Sacramento, they tuned into the That's show awesome. every single day. So I got to meet Victor. <laughs> and, and his grandmother, Anna, who lives in uh, Midtown Sacramento, is watching right now. She's a huge fan of Cody, huge fan of the show. Hi. Uh, so I told Victor, I want to say hi to Anna by name because she's one of those fantastic viewers of Good Day Sacramento. And we That's love awesome. that. That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, no matter what part of the state you're in. Yeah. That's really yeah. cool. That's really cool. <laughs> well, there you Hi, go. Anna. Hello, Anna. All right. Uh, there's a link to Travel Zoo and Good Day Sacramento.